Hello and welcome to the data structure tutorial. Today we are going to learn heap. So what is heap? So heap is uh, another set of binary tree which has uh, two property in it. First, that it's a the binary tree. It's a binary tree. Uh, it's uh, the other property you can say it's follow a heap order. Heap order means uh, in a given binary tree, the root node will either be less than from the right side or the right left side or the root node will be greater than its left side and its right side okay if these two criteria meet then we can say it's a heap a heap tree okay so we will see what is so heap comes in two forms uh, uh, the first one we can say a max heap the second one is a min heap so max heap follow the property of where the root node will always be greater than from its left side and from its right side. So let us see what a max heap by example. <coughs> so in a max heap, let's say I have a root node 90. So by heap order property, the root node will always be greater than from its left side to its right side. So, I can say 70, 80. Okay. So, if I take this root node, parent node, so this will be always greater than its left and its right. Okay. So, if I take this, else, so it will be always be greater than its left and its right. So, so at any any level, okay, from 80 it is greater than 65 and 55. So it follow the heap property. 90 is greater than 70 and 80. So it follow the uh, heap property. Because 90 is greater than 70 and it's greater than 80. And it's a bind. So if you want to represent this n in an array. So what we have to do? So we have to follow the binary tree convention. Like uh, the root node will be stored at the first element of the array, and the left child will be stored at two to the right location. Right child will be stored at i plus one, and if you want to parent, I will say i by two. So let's apply this formula. So I will store 90, I will create an array size, okay, I will first level, the second level with 2, 2 into 1, I will say 70, the third level with 2 into 1 plus 1, it's 80. Now, I have traversed both the left side and right side, then I move to 70. So what is my 2 into 2 is 4. What is my force? 60, then 50. So if you want to represent this uh, max shape into a array, so we uh, you know this is a binary tree, and so it has to follow the binary tree property. Uh, quick recap. Uh, binary tree property means the parent element will be stored at the first location of the array. The left child will be stored at 2 to the right location. The right child will store at i plus location. So if we if we create an array and uh, we will say the first element of the array will be 90. The second element of the array will be 2 in, into i 70. Okay. The third location will be 80. Right side. Then this will be the next parent. For 70, 60 is my left to 2 into 2 is 4. So fifth element will be 50. Then we will move the counter to here. So for 80, 65 will be the left child, 55 will be the right child. 
then we will come to 60 for 60 30 will be the left child 40 will be the right child ok so if you are say what is the parent of 6th element 6th element is 65 so we will say 6 by 2 that is 3 so 3 is 80 so 80 is the parent of 3 so let us see 80 is the parent of 65 so it, it follow the binary tree property and the heap. Okay.